Hi all, welcome back to another video. On this video, we are moving. On this video, we are going to discuss some question answers based on social science on the topic NMMS scholarship examination, National Means Committee scholarship examination. So we are moving on to the first question. First of all, you have to go through all these questions, and also you may write it on your notebook. First question. Here it is from the social science part. Which of the following is not an example of a renewable energy source? We already learned what is renewable energy and non-renewable energy. Here, which is not an example of renewable energy source? Option one: coal. Two: solar energy. 3 wind power and 4 biogas which is the right option yes the right answer is option 1 coal okay other we know biogas solar energy and wind power then moving on to the next one the term of the president what is the term of the president option 1 6 year 2 5 year 3 4 year and 4 7 year right answer the term of the president is 5 year okay 5 years is the right answer then who is known as the missile man of india as we know who is the missile man of india going to the first option option 1 dr rajendra prasad Two, Dr. Shankar Dayal Sharma. Option three, APJ Abdul Kalam. Option four, Dr. K. R. Narayan. Who is known as the missile man of India? We already know that the option three, Dr. APJ Abdul Kalam, is known as the missile man of India. Okay, keep in mind. Then we are moving on to the next question, seventy-six. When did the Child Labour Act prohibition and regulation came into force? When did the Child Labour Act came into force? 1. 1952 2. 1935 3. 2014 and 1986 Which is the right answer? Yes, on 1986 Okay The Child Labour Act came into force then when was the first world religions conference held there are some years go through those years 1893 1883 1839 1898 tricky isn't it tricky question the right answer is option one 1893 then the hero of the caste reform movement in the south was Option 1. D.K. Kao 2. Vedad Linkam 3. E.V. Ramaswamy 4. None of this Which is the right answer? Yes Option 3. E.V. Ramaswamy Is a hero of the caste reform movement in the south Okay Then next question where was Dayananda Saraswati born? We know who is Dayananda Saraswati and where was he born? Option 1 Maharashtra, 2 Gujarat, 3 Bihar and 4 Rajasthan. Where did Dayananda Saraswati born? Yes, on Gujarat. Then the next there was a complete ban on the practice of sati okay there was a complete ban on the practice of sati who is the answer option one lord hastings i think that we already discussed somewhere else 
Lord Hastings, two Lord William Bentinck, three Lord Dalhousie, and four Lord Canning. Right answer is option two, Lord Bentinck. Option two, Lord William Bentinck. Then the next, who wrote the book Stree Purush Comparison? Who wrote the book Stree Purush Comparison? One. Mahadevi Verma, two, Raj Sundari Devi, three, Thara Bai Shinte, four, Prabhavadi Devi. Who is the right answer, or who wrote the book Stri Purush Comparison? The right answer is option three, Thara Bai Shinte. Next question: The process of taking out minerals from the rocks buried inside the earth is called option one, mining. erosion deposit none of these which is the right answer yes mining is the process of taking out minerals from the rocks buried inside the earth then nuwa namundi kiriburu kiriburu and ari are the major mining centers of which mineral one manganese Two coal, three iron ore, four gold. Nova, Namundi, Kiriburu, and Ari. Right answer is option three. Iron ore, iron ore. Then does not match. Find out the right answer. Option one T Assam. Two wheat Haryana. Three rubber, Rajasthan. Four sugar cane, Uttar Pradesh. Yes, right answer is option two. Wheat, Haryana. The next, what is the white revolution related to? We already learned white revolution. What is the right answer from the option one? Production of crops. Two, improve animal breeds to increase milk production. Three fruit production, four none of the above. It's a simple question. What is the white revolution related to? Improve animal breeds to increase milk production. White revolution, milk production. Then, when was the Constitution of India prepared? Option one, November nineteen forty-six. Two, November nineteen forty-seven. Number nineteen forty-eight and number nineteen forty-nine. Twenty-six. Number nineteen forty-nine. Then, what type of government system is the in India? What type of government system is the in India? Option one: democratic. Two: monarchy. Three: dictatorship. Four: oligarchy. We know it's a simple question. Democratic, okay. Democratic system is the in our India. Then, next question: Where is the Supreme Court of India located? I have to mention the place. Go through the options. Where is the Supreme Court of India located? One Mumbai, two Lucknow, three New Delhi, and Kolkata. Which is the right answer? Yes, on New Delhi. The Supreme Court of India is located on New Delhi. What is the retirement age of Supreme Court judges? Sixty-five year, sixty year, fifty-five year, and seventy year. Right answer. Keep in mind, sixty-five year is the retirement age of Supreme Court judges. Then. The next question and the final question of this video: When was the Constituent Assembly of India formed? Going through the options: Option one, July nineteen forty-six; two, December nineteen forty-seven; three, December nineteen forty-eight; and four, December nineteen forty-nine. Which is the right answer? Is yes, on July nineteen forty-six. So we are moving or uh, going to conclude this video
I think all of you got the answers and the questions well.